So to make rivets, you need some thin metal. So I smoke the odd cigar. So that's quite good metal to use. And you can see I've used the cap, which is why some of the bolts and rivets were sort of red topped. I use a nail punch, which is basically punching nails in, so they go flush. You can get them in different sizes. This is quite small. And I've got a rubber or an eraser for pencils. Lay that on there. Force it through. simply how I do it.
it's, it's dried overnight. Looks okay. And what we're going to do now, mix up some polyfiller, some wool filler, um, with a little bit of sand and smooth out some of these areas because some of them are going to be rocks but some of them are going to be sort of grassed areas and I might have a little go see if I can just thin it well level out sorry some of the um, bottom of the trenches
there's gaps now between the shoring of the wood and the ground. I'm just going to fill that in there with some more of this um, sort of dirt mixture. I've got a tub of leftover grass from other projects, all sorts of lengths in there, and I'm going to use this um, now on this diorama. 